guys, it's Ranks here, and today we are making another Wolf Size Dawn video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys the newest map added into the game. But before we get started with that, I would just like to quickly mention that I am now partnered with Exarch and Gaming. They are a company that has things such as amazing chairs, desks, accessories, and more for your gaming setup. If any of this sounds interesting to you, you can go down to the link down below in the description, check out their website, and if you find anything you like, when checking out, you can use the code Lyronix10 and get 10% off of any item of your choice. Okay, and I believe that this actually came out quite a few days ago but i i realized i noticed okay i did notice when it came out but we're here to look at it so yeah so in game release of wild forest map so that's that's a new map right there now i'm not sure if this is replacing the one that was there before because that's what it kind of seems like the other one is gone now so maybe this map has like qualities that the other one has or maybe it's completely different but we're, we're gonna check that out. And yet again, we'll realize that now, again, checking it out, that the whole little setup is different from how it was before. I feel like with every little update they have, like, something just drastically changes, though, other than just that one thing that they said that changed. Because as you will realize, now we have the map, like, over here in this corner. We have Wolf over here and the customization options down in the bottom corner, which before they were just kind of up on the screen, but now you have to click to access them. So... Yes, but anyways, we're not we're not even gonna worry about what the wolf looks like. All right, first thing we'll notice is I'm in a really different area. <laughs> this is definitely very different from the usual spawn area. You do have like little spawn pad though, which I do think I remember. Maybe <laughs> the trees definitely look much different from how they were before, and they're moving too, which is really cool. Look at the trees. I keep forgetting to pick adult, but it's okay. We can we can work with a child it's we got this all right anyways where are we where do i start like this map seems kind of big will i be able to cover everything who knows anyways moving on <laughs> um we're just gonna check out this forest i guess it's kind of crazy oh my gosh it's bright now <laughs> Dude, it's getting hard to see. Is that what it's like every morning? <laughs> Good thing I'm not up that early. Oh my god. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> this is hard to see. Where is it? I can't- I literally cannot look that way. I'm not even going to look that way. We're gonna keep moving on this way, not even looking behind us. There's little mushrooms too, though. They're like the size of me. Why am I so tiny? <laughs> oh my goodness. You gone? Nope. Still there. Still really bright. Now, now it looks so nice out. Oh my goodness. Goodness, I feel so tiny. <laughs> oh my god, just because I am tiny, but like I feel really tiny. This map is so cool. What? Oh my gosh, I like that the trees like move now. I really like that. And like there's like little wind lines. Whoosh, you know. <laughs> oh, I'm very good again at explaining what I'm trying to talk about. But the 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 white little marks you're seeing like flying across the screen that's supposed to resemble the wind, I find is really cool. This pond looks amazing. What I I, oh, I love how this looks, like, the lily pads on top of it, just the water. I know it doesn't look like realistic water or anything, but I just really like how it looks. Because what I like about it is that they fit the map to fit the model. Which, by, what I mean by that is that it's just as cartoony as the model itself. Usually in most animal games, we'll notice that there is, like, a really cartoony looking model, but then have the most, like, realistic looking map out there usually kind of the map that you get when you when you work in roblox studio so it's not really a creative map other than putting in your own building but i really like this map because it's definitely it feels like it just would fit this model like if someone was to draw this you know just i feel like it all just works so well together but i feel like usually if someone was to draw a really cartoony wolf but then like the most realistic background you know you might feel like it's a tad bit off <laughs> i mean it definitely might look cool but i feel like it's just you know you'd want it to kind of fit the model more and that's what i really like about this map i just feel like it's so nice to be in it's definitely fits the aesthetic of the game 
honestly. It definitely, though, is really different from the older games, the older Wolf's Lives game, which is really crazy to me how it changed so much. And then also how this model changed so much from when they first came out with the Wolf's Lives Dawn. So the model has honestly been all over the place. I mean, I don't know. I kind of liked the first one, but this guy is definitely cool as well. I just feel like with the newborn, it it just kind of looks like a shrunk adult, you know? But usually in Wolf's Size games, when there's like an adult or a child, usually the child will have different features from the adult. But this is basically, again, just a shrunken version of the adult. So not much of a difference other than the fact that it's tiny. <laughs> but still cool. Really like it. I mean, this map is really nice. I'm confused though if that means they got rid of the original spawn area map that we had seen in like the last video i made i mean i really like that map too so i'm hoping that one's not going anywhere but i didn't see it so it might be gone but hopefully not that map was pretty cool there's so many what the heck <laughs> i've like passed like a river and i was in a swampy area and now i'm in a pit with wolf head on the wall you know it's crazy what <laughs> this map is so big this is what i was kind of worried about was like if i was going to be able to see everything going around here because i just feel like it's so big that i'm definitely going to miss like a few things because one the videos aren't usually that insanely long and i honestly don't know my way around the map at right now because you know new map <laughs> So, uh, I'm kind of just working my way around here, trying to figure it out, seeing what I haven't seen before, definitely. How do I- where am I? <laughs> I'm trying to get out of here now. I think this is the way- oh no, it's getting misty again. Misty. Oh my gosh, okay. But yeah, this map is like honestly super cool. Again, probably haven't seen everything, but I've seen quite enough to actually impress me. So... <laughs> um definitely a really cool map again love it love the game i feel like it definitely takes a while to update but it, it's definitely worth it you know you can definitely tell a game that's like worth the weight of the updates you know because sometimes it's like a game and it doesn't update forever and you just like lose interest in it but this one i can like kind of come back to and check it out and like with full surprise and you know excitement for what it is you know because you could you definitely like expect a lot from this game <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, that's gonna be it for this video. If you guys like this video, make sure to like, subscribe, part of the squad. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!